In this video, we're going to learn about the difference between percentage change and percentage difference. So percentage change is used when you want to see by how much a value has changed. So the way you would calculate it is you would calculate percent change is equal to the new value, subtract the old value, divided by the old value times 100. And if the number is positive, there's been an increase. And if the number become, is negative, there's been a decrease. So in our example, um, we're imagining that we're at a store and yesterday there were 200 customers and today there are 240. So the percentage change is equal to the new value, 240 minus 200. We divide that by the old value, so 200 and then we multiply our answer by 100. So that will work out to be 20%. Because it's positive, it means that we've had a 20% increase from yesterday. Now percentage difference is a bit different. Um, it's used when you have two values, but they mean the same kind of thing. For instance, you're comparing the heights of two different people. So there's not an initial value or a final value. So you don't use this when you do have an initial or final, you would use the percentage change instead. So the way you calculate this is percent difference is equal to the difference between the two values divided by the average of the two values times 100. So in our example, we see that Alex sold 15 tickets and Sam sold 25. So we'll set this up so the percentage difference is equal to, we'll find the difference between the two, so 25 minus 15 divided by the average of the two, so 25 plus 15 divided by 2 times 100. So that's equal to 10 divided by 20 times 100 equals 50% difference between the two values. So we don't know if it's an increase or a decrease, it, it doesn't matter, there's just a 50% difference in sales between the two.